Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how to fix common uh, Windows 10 startup problems such as a black screen, maybe blue screen of death, um, infinite uh, looping. Uh, you might get a screen similar to this one. So I hope you find this guide useful. If you do, please help me out by subscribing to my channel. Okay, so to fix this problem, you need to put the Windows 10 install media into your machine. Um, if you don't have a Windows 10 install media, you need to go onto another machine that can access the desktop. If you go to Google, Google Windows 10 ISO. Here on the official Microsoft website, you can download a tool that you can use to create a bootable USB drive or a bootable DVD. Uh, so it's not that one update now. If you just scroll down, download tool. So if you download that and then follow the prompts, um, so if you put the Windows 10 install media into your machine, restart your machine, and when it says here, press any key to boot from CD or DVD, just press any key. This screen usually takes about a minute or so to load. I've got quite a fast PC, so it's a bit quick. Um, so select your region here, United States. So press next. Do not click on install now. Down the bottom left here, click on repair your computer. So at this option, click on troubleshoot, advanced options. Now the first thing I like to do is go to the command prompt and run what's called a check disk. So if you select command prompt, type in chkdsk c colon space forward slash f space forward slash r so what this is going to do is it's going to scan your um, computer for any corrupt files or bad sectors and it's going to automatically fix them um, it's possible that one of those corrupt files is causing windows not to boot so i like to do this first because this doesn't change anything on your system it simply just fixes a file so as we can see here the process has finished so just exit and then come back to here and click on turn off your PC. So the, turn off your PC, remove the Windows 10 install media, try to boot to Windows again. If you don't get to the desktop, uh, put your Windows 10 install media back in again. Come back to this option, click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then click on startup repair. That's going to launch an application um, that will basically scan your Windows 10 um, boot up files. It will see if there it can find any issues. If it can't find any issues, it will replace all the files. Um, so that will take probably about two to five minutes to run. So again, once that's finished, shut down your machine, start your machine back up again, and hopefully it will boot to the desktop. If not, there's one more thing that we can do. Click on reset this PC. So what this is going to do is you can either install a clean um, version of Windows. So it will basically format your system and then install Windows again. Or it does actually say here it allows you to keep your files. So it basically just reinstalls Windows um, over the top of where it is now. You will lose any applications that you might have, like you might install Microsoft Office or Adobe Acrobat Reader. Uh, those programs will not be preserved, you'll have to reinstall them again. Uh, so this option will be a last resort um, thing that you want to do because yeah, it's, it's quite a big thing to do. But okay, after you follow those steps you shouldn't have any more problems. Uh, if you do have any questions about this video or if you do have any problems after this, please post them in a the comment below and I'll help you out. But thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.